The house with the grain and Lafayette and contain the threat. Do you have it in sight? Right in front of me. Good. Assess the situation once there and proceed with caution. Did Nicola provide you with armament? Yes. Essex M2 Falchion. Good. The Falchion secondary ordnance should help. Okay, just fine. Just we may be pursuing Bedlamites, but they remain civilians. Use non-lethal force whenever possible. Understood. Are you joining us? I have a small matter to attend to. I'll find you afterwards. En route now. Got it out. I like the part that looking at the guns. It shows that how much detail they put into everything in this game. You can check the de entire details of the gun by looking at it from almost everything. Okay, almost everything. Right now, so okay. walking it is, and down the stairs we go. So, uh, look at the graphics. Ah, we need to meet in green. Let's look at the graphics. There's R3, and it's meet in green. Is that guy in green? Morning. Apparently not. Oh, something. Uh, if you want to read this, pause it and read it. Let's just continue with the game now. Anything over here? Can we open that door? No, and most probably we can't open that as well. Oh, we're in the third floor. We need to go tricky down, unless this ingrained guy is in the floor below us. And walking feels so slow. Especially in games. And another thing that we can watch. See. Windham family. No idea who they are. Is this guy in green? Good day, sir. No. Anything? Can we do anything? Nothing. Yes, most probably no. Not in green. Nothing to do here. This move. Yeah. Football. Pat, 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 pat. Yeah. Phonograph cylinder. Back to this container. Record audio message. Play option. Okay. in the days of Uther Pendragon, when he was king of all England, and so reigned that there was a mighty duke in Cornwall that held war against him long time, and the duke was called the Duke of Tintagil. And so by means, King Uther sent for this duke, charging him to bring his wife with him, for she was called a fair lady, and a passing wise, and her name was called Igraine. So when the duke and his wife would come unto the king, 
By the means of great lords, they were accorded both. The king liked and loved this lady well, and he made them great cheer out of measure, and desired to have lain by her. But she was a passing good woman, and would not assent unto the king. And then she told the duke her husband, and said, I suppose that we were sent for, that I should be dishonored. Wherefore, husband, I counsel you, that we depart from hence suddenly, that we may ride all night unto our own castle. That Uther and Dragon's must be altered. I'm on my way down to the street. Acknowledge. So we jump down? Then we run now. Spin. Man, allow me to run. I hate walking. Use the ladder and we go down. Come on, just slide down, slide down, slide down. Alright. Galahad, the grey. Any word from the fire? Negative. Same here. He's probably off somewhere gallivanting. Being. Well. Himself. I know your concerns, but trust me, he's a good lad. Did you say so? In any case, I have no time to look for him. I'm assigning the last few constables to their posts. And this is the ring of Madeleine. The game is from now. Oh, Charles Dickens. Nice. Coffee, tea, sorry, most probably, since it's in there. And this, come on, allow me to run. Why the hell is he not running? Come on, did my PS4 controller already spoil? Yes, Constable, that is clearly the case. Perhaps he needs a glass of water. This man does not need a drink. He has asthma. Are you a doctor, Mark? I've seen plenty of people struggling. Not turning back for this. Why would they not tell us the reason why? Oh, sure. Oh, my dear. This man needs medical attention. <laughs> Unfortunately, ma'am, all medical personnel are currently unavailable. Throat. Bugger off. Please watch your things. Galahad, see that you cordon off the entire district and do it quietly. How did you arrive here so quickly? Skill, love. I must admit, you do move fast for a man of your age. And I cares to be reminded of his decrepitude by a fair damsel. My lord, this damsel would never be so callous as to do such a thing. Sure is he. Would you ever? <laughs> Who are the marks? Bedlamites running amok. Percival thinks it could be a rebel subterfuge. Let's hope you haven't lost your edge. Remember who trained you? He was the best. In his day. Was. You're still pretty good. But I'm better. Yes, ma'am. Big rain, come in. Acknowledge, Percival. Multiple escapees spotted at the east entrance of the United India Underground Station. Intercept with caution. Understood. Come on, Gray. Let's move. Okay, there's something. Finally. Once we're inside, don't let anyone else through. Sure you don't need help, love. Do you mean a strong man to take control of things? That's right. Just stay out of our way. I'd hate for you to get shot by mistake. 
trouble. The usual trigger-happy mercenaries. The United India Company prefers its minions enthusiastic. The last thing we need is a band of hired guns causing more havoc. I've told them to remain on lockdown. Find some weapons. You two, get your asses over here. I need help. Come on. Go. Let's go, you bloody bastards. A rifle would be more appropriate. Escape me down. More escapees coming from the alley. Some are heading for the atrium. Enemy down. There could be more in the atrium. We should move in. They've locked the door. 
I can hear more commotion inside. 